the Hoolies Maiden is next. And there's just three in this, so it feels like getting smaller. <laughs> it's two miles and one furlong Maiden Chase, and at the top we've got a fond mort for David Hooley. I'm a Spartacus for Paul Rhodes and nothing fancy for Martin Leadham, so let's hope we don't get too many fallers. Oh, we could have jockeys chasing horses around the track, trying to remount. Anyway, they're away and racing, and just the three of them. And all safely over the first. Twelve more fences to negotiate then. And nothing fancy is in the lead. Just from Iron Spartacus and Fondemort. And all three of these trainers already had a winner so far this season, then with nothing fancy's trainer having taken the previous race. David Hooley's already had about seven or eight winners, and Paul Rhodes had one yesterday. They get over the second. They're all safely over that. With nothing fancy, the leader, Fondemort second, and I'm Spartacus in third place. Over the next, that's the third. Come on past the big screen, past the winning post, complete circuit of the track to go. And this is a Two mile one furlong, of course, so you'd expect the pace to be quite hot. It doesn't appear to be that quick at the minute. There's only three of them. It's bound to be more of a tactical cat and mouse affair than normal. And Fondemort on the inside of Nothing Fancy. And then I am Spartacus back in third. Over that ditch, they all got over it okay. Nothing Fancy in front. One more in second, and I am Spartacus third. All nicely over the sixth, although I am Spartacus was a little bit awkward on landing. Nothing fancy continues to lead them as they race into the final half of the race with nothing fancy and Fond more, and they've just pulled five or six clear of I am Spartacus at the moment. Another jock is giving that one a bit of a breather rather than he's finding the pace too hot, difficult to tell. And over that next one they go slower jump there by Nothing Fancy has allowed Fondmort to jump into the lead. So Fondmort's now a length clear of Nothing Fancy in second. Gap of six or seven back to I am Spartacus to get over the next one. Oh, this time Nothing Fancy hits it quite hard and has really dropped back. Well, I'll put pay to her chances then now, but Fondmort is in the lead. Nothing fancy trying to battle back, jump that one nicely. But they've still got a good four to take. And Fondmort and Nothing Fancy are still clear of I Am Spartacus as they come down to the fourth last. And over that one, Fondmort in front. Nothing fancy going well on the flat. Is back within half a length of the leader. Gap of six back to I Am Spartacus who's starting to run on. And it's Fondmort on the inside of Nothing Fancy. Coming down towards the final three fences then there. And Fondmort on the inside jumped that one better. Nothing fancy in second. I am Spartacus is now starting to make significant progress at the back. And is getting closer with every stride. Fondmort kicks on for home. Fondmort racing down towards the final two fences. It looks like Fondmort might be the stronger of the three at the moment. Fondmort's quickly gone four clear. Nothing fancy. How much did those two mistakes take out of her? She's trying to run in second. I am Spartacus is still trying to run on in third. But this looks like Fondmort in the lead over the second last. Mistake by. I'm smart because that one's now out of it. His Fondmort jockey has a little look around. He knows he's only got to put the last to take it, I think. Nothing fancy. He's gallantly trying to run on again. But Fondmort pops the last. But a better jump by Nothing Fancy. Nothing Fancy powers up the straight. And Fondmort suddenly got work to do. Nothing Fancy trying to close. Fondmort, Nothing Fancy. Fondmort asserts. And Fondmort takes it. Nothing Fancy brave in second. I'm smart because was third. And the three runner race suddenly turned out to be quite exciting. As it looked like that slow jump at the last night had given nothing fancy a chance, but maybe those two mistakes took too much out of her and Fondmort battled on to take it. So another one on the book for David Hooley. Fondmort is the winner, beating the local horse, nothing fancy in second. I'm Spartacus was third for Paul Rhodes.